uh, we're playing the game called Hinsight, and the developer is Team Hinsight, and the publisher is Annapurna Interactive. They're publishing, um, so far they published pretty good games, except one I don't want to talk about. <laughs> and I'm still, <laughs> I've still got PTSD from that. Um, yeah, and on Steam it's saying, what if the physical objects of everyday life, the possessions we hold close, were actual windows to the past? Peer into distant memories and unseen futures and insight. The texts are exploration, story rich and cinematic. So um, I hope it's going to be a good game. A nice gem we're playing tonight. <coughs> and I hope it's not going to be too too emotional because uh, I don't want to cry. <laughs> ah, hi, Mix. So hi there. Welcome to the stream. Hope you think it. Click and drag left mouse to rotate the camera. Let's do that. Very dark, huh? I'm doing all right, Mixo. I'm doing all right. What about yourself? Your voice sounds way better today, right? Every day it's getting a little better. I'm very grateful for that. I'm waking up and I'm like, hmm, let me speak a bit. Okay, my morning voice is still a bit different, but yeah. It's getting better. So we're at the beach. I'm not sure where to start. It almost feels impossible. The soundtrack seems uh, very, very nice. It's like I'm playing a movie. <coughs> the past meets with the present. I'm inside of a space. movie. A lifetime worth of memories. <laughs> Getting older. And I can even hear a heartbeat. Oh, this is going to be an emotional game, I think. Remember through my eyes. You know what's interesting? If you're asking old people like 80, 90 years old, they're going to say in their head they're still feeling like 20. It's they're just their body who are getting it, which is getting older, you know? I think that's a very interesting thought. I'm really not looking forward to the hot temperatures returning, but other than that, I'm doing all right myself. Hope you get well soon. Thank you so much, Mixo. And yeah, I heard that there's going to be the next heat wave coming. Uh, I am... Um, right now, it's way too cold at my place here. Danish summer is insanely cold, but I'm not going to complain. I know um, I, I'm missing a bit the sun, but I am not missing the heat. Uh, whoop. That was fast. <laughs> this ch children's face is a bit creepy, though. It's looking like Benjamin Button. Let's see, what can we do now? Probably here. I tried to figure out if this is like a ah oh, interesting perspective change. <laughs> so sometimes the objectives are um, flickering a bit. And sometimes you probably need to find the right angle. We're growing very I fast. Know where we're at in life, our perception of a memory changes. <laughs> that is true. Mary. <laughs> that's cool. Guess that's uh, my room, huh? 
I I can't remember much when I was a child though. Know which version is the truth. Isn't that crazy? Do I have to do something here? Ah, through the, the carpet. Oh, hi. <laughs> Chat. <laughs> Oops, I messed it up. What? Chat. Okay, this is uh, this is hard. Okay. <laughs> That's cool though, that's a great idea. It's always so satisfying to clean things. <laughs> can I click here now? Yes, I can. Hello, Mimi. <laughs> Hello, Kev. <coughs> I used to think I knew exactly who you were. The idea of you captured perfectly in my mind. <laughs> That's looking dangerous. Yep. I told myself you had your own ways of showing you cared. Ways I didn't understand until I was much older. Better late than never, I guess. Is that Despite a bar? Our best efforts, life is unpredictable. Doesn't care who you are, what you're doing, or what you have planned. Oh, I love the voice actor. She has an amazing voice. Could listen to this the whole time. I'm, I'm surprised begin, there is a voice acting sometimes here. Sometimes, when you least expect it, things end. That's true. It's hard not to think about how time has changed the memory of you. Maybe when do you defeat Market and I'll Probably never. <laughs> Elton Ring is not a game I'm gonna finish. There is no way. Too hard. How it will continue to change, to shift. Until I'm left with a version I've created in my head. But also, I was also never a huge fan of uh, Dark Souls. Elden Ring is easy. Th yeah, that's coming from a guy who got every achievement there. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Suddenly everything is going so fast in this uh, in this game. Life is very much unpredictable indeed. I think you do fine in Elden Ring. <laughs> <laughs> You're trusting me way too much, Tess. There it is, inside. This is how the game starts. I assume that's my passport, right? And I'm doing some kind of music. Those are the keys to the house. 
so I assume that was a bar or something. That's already the, the second chapter still alive or still alive. I know so, <laughs> you're too kind. <laughs> what happened to the dancing? Ah, oh, Knabbers, don't ask. No. Um I decided that we're gonna stop. We're gonna we're gonna do the second zone at some point. Uh Nicker Dancer broke an angle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kinda like that. Now <clears throat> it was a bit a bit repetitive and uh, I I said to myself, I was a bit honest to myself with like I I'm probably not gonna play this for a long time. So um I'm gonna try something else now. One of the newer games which got released also just a couple of days ago, I think. At least I got the notification. So we're at the airport. What's next? Of course, we're standing in front of it because we want to check the flights. I assume. I love flying, by the way. <laughs> I love... I, I really love that it's just rarely happening. It's like a big dream scene. An interesting perspective. You don't like flying? I love flying. I was even thinking about being a pilot. But my eyes were always Everything too bad. still looks the same. I can't tell if that's comforting or not. <laughs> I don't like looking at the front porch and not seeing you there. <clears throat> ah, I know that feeling. Is that a game where we're gonna start to cry? I I think so, yeah. I think it's about losing a person suddenly. And how to keep moving on with life. Just life itself. I hate flying, I love flying. You came here to relax, to catch your breath, to be at peace. And every time Maybe I'm, I'm seeing birds, longer, I'll feel it too. Every time I'm seeing birds, I'm just so jealous because I will never know, we will never know how it is to to feel the wind under your wings, you know? I'm, I was very jealous about that. <coughs> I used to have a fear for flying with airplanes when I was little, but I overcome the fear. There is, it's not, it's not reasonable, that fear. I know it doesn't make sense, but flying is one of the mm, safest way to travel. I cry really easy. <laughs> yeah, me too, Adelia. I'm a, I'm a little cry baby with aunt. <laughs> the visuals are great. I like the idea. And again, I'm in lurk mode. Sorry, but it's too much. No, please don't be sorry. That's completely fine. That's completely fine. You, you, you just want to enjoy your time. And if the topic is too sensitive or triggering, then it's uh, always better to tune out or lurk or doing something else. I have no idea. That was just my guess um, what this game is about. The music is wonderful. Very atmospheric. We all went hiking sometimes. You packed the lunch, Dad mapped the trail. I was in charge of pointing out all the good rocks and trees. Or somebody is, I think it's just the life. Of a of one person, and we're looking back and uh, reflecting about everything, you know. But 
It's true. There is a higher chance to win a lottery than experience an accident with airplane. Yeah. It just... Crashes or accidents with airplanes are just very hard to 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 hear or to see and it's very brutal but it's very very safe to travel with the airplanes but i wanted to wander and see where the trees took me i just wanted uh, want to see mammoth tree damn where can you see one even She was looking above. Should I do the same? Ah. Must be so impressive. I can imagine now. I can see why you liked being outside. Sitting here, listening to the branches dance against the breeze. The smell of coffee brewing. Mmm, I love Daddy that smell. Brought you a cup. It's my telling. <laughs> yeah, indeed. It's so interesting. You're changing perspective outdoors, and stepping fields. into the... I called out shapes into the foot of your parents. I followed ants back to their home. I pulled up weeds thinking they were flowers and made crowns. <laughs> but why is this not working? Maybe from this perspective. <laughs> That's very cool. Yeah, I did this so, so many times. Sherman has you such a great word sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> Those wordplays are nice, huh? Oh, what a night. What a sky. So beautiful. It's like we're playing a visual novel today, huh? The moon? And now we're going back again. This is so cute. It is, right? What story did you and memories tell? Fly me to the moon. I never did camping in my life. I always wanted to do that. I think I'm missing out some experiences. Zip. You're missing the sound of the birds. <laughs> I'm also missing my boys. <laughs> Soon again. My boys. Ah, over there. What happened? I am not at home right now. I'm not at home right now. That's why. That's we don't. That's why we don't have a bird cam. Do we have to look at the house, maybe? Oh no, this toy here. Camping is fun, but also depends on the condition. Yeah, of course it depends, of course.
Damn, do you have to do something here? I guess so. This looks right, but I can't go. Hmm. Now I got it. <laughs> Work out with newbie in the background? <laughs> no, please not. Newbie cam. Damn, that's lots of love for a newbie. <laughs> oh, the smell of fresh, uh, fresh clothes is so good. Oh, that's so nice. That's a nice memory here. Where do you have to click? Maybe this one? No. Or am I going back? Yes, by climbing rope is in the back. <laughs> no. <laughs> and doing the crab walk. So what do we have to do, little girl? Helping mom? Because I had to help my mom. Oh, he over here. That was small. Let's see, maybe we have to jump to the other side. Oh, there it is. Maybe has to tweet for us. <laughs> Substitute for Leo. <laughs> I mean, Leo's song or Zazu's song is always the same. And then it starts again. Music club. Hello, Kev. Hi there. Welcome to the stream. Good evening. It's interesting to see the steps when you want to going back. It's always past, present. You're always switching between times, different times. And the whole house is looking familiar, but still it's a bit different. This yard holds a lot of memories. Watching you pull weeds. Spraying grass with the hose. I beg you to <laughs> splash me with water during the summer and you'd sigh real big. But you would. That's an amazing shot of you. Daydreaming became as normal as breathing. Imagining made up places and letting my mind wander. I think I have to click on the drops here. Yes. I love to do this, not just love to do this, I love to watch 
when the teardrops were f falling and I was always imagining a race. They are doing like a, a water race here and I was like, which one, which one is faster? Funny, that's super nice to see here. <laughs> Such a nice childhood uh, memory here. Playing with rain, right? <laughs> My imaginary uh, rain races on the window. <laughs> the raindrops were racing down the wind, right? It's funny that you guys also had this memory also, or also thinking about that. <laughs> it's nostalgic. It is so nostalgic. So wholesome. Everything in just one little drop. Sometimes our mind is just uh, drifting away. Oh, oh, I have to do that. <laughs> Little girl. Oh, I think I did a mistake. Yep, I accidentally clicked there. Except this scene, never had it. No, I also didn't have that with my dad. Spin the camera in one direction to progress time. Bird watching? The big oak tree is where I thrived. I climbed it so many times, my knees were always scratched up. Bird watching. <laughs> That's cute. Birdie flying away. I always wanted to have a tree house. I also climbed a lot of trees when I was the same. Same. I was always sitting on trees. So useful. And so comfy, to be honest. I guess I have to click here again. Um, are we jumping? <laughs> uh, that looks dangerous. <laughs> now we're on the tray. Fun memories? Oh yeah, for sure. Dude, now I want to climb trees again. <laughs> oh, hi birdie! No! <laughs> Big bird. <laughs> That's cute. And then one day I fell. I wasn't hurt, just scared. I ran to you for comfort, crying. You frowned and told me it was my fault for climbing too high. You watched me carefully for the next few days. Had Dad cut down weak branches. 
I mean, that's also part of climbing, right? Falling down. That's just part of it. <laughs> Leo. <laughs> I'm missing my birds now. Uh, wait, is that a phone in game or in real life? That's in game, right? I just checked my phone, it's not vibrating. Now it must be in game. <laughs> oh, wow. The restaurant called. It's easy to forget that the world I got moving. confused. Cleaning out the house shouldn't take long. Always work, work. Learning from uh, your mistakes. Or for your mistakes. Yeah, that's part of life, yeah. It just... Uh, part of our lives. Hello, Bastion. Hi there. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing good. Da, da, da. Let's see. What can we do here? How did I lose touch with what was important? Most of the time, it's most of the time it is because we're starting with working and then we're just having less time for a lot of other things. Summer full? Wait a second, you're calling this summer full? Like a summer bird? <laughs> funny. <laughs> it's funny. Wait, it also in Danish? That's so funny. The <laughs> I was, <clears throat> I was uh, thinking the last time I learned a new word um, in Danish. It's called jellyfish, but <laughs> it is, it is the a combination of two words in in Danish, like um, water and man. And I was thinking, why is it called Waterman? Until I figured out it's jellyfish in Danish. Funny. Then man. <laughs> That's so funny to me. I ask as if you'd have the answer. I'll never know. I like some of wool. How do you choose what's most important? Oh, that's pff, that's hard to say. My bike. I don't have audio, but less than three. <laughs> Dear Don, no, you probably don't hear me, but thank you so much for the Prime Gaming and thank you very, very much for 11 month. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you soon. And welcome to the stream. Hi, people. I'm doing OK. What about yourself? Welcome as well. Good to see you. So are we going to save memories with the gardening, with our bike, or with being outside? I think I'm, I'm going to take the gardening because it was important for my mom. Yeah, I'm going to take that. Decision making, mom guess. And now we're back in our apartment again. It's suddenly it's so gray here. Some music. Third chapter within the lines. Well, let's walk this way then. There are probably still pictures here. But I feel so different. Like a stranger that doesn't belong. Many years just passed, and yeah, of course. But it's all gonna be the same house. Shoes off, slippers on. But I'd always forget. 
It was the first thing you'd ask me to do when we came home. <laughs> like a ritual meant to be followed without question. She even remembers even those now, details. I find it hard to remember. Now, time to clean up everything, time to take everything. Oi, oi, oi. Oh, there's a picture. Or a memo. I wonder what that means. You tried to teach me about my culture from an early age. And sometimes it meant skipping out on time with friends. <laughs> the food you ate, the language you spoke, they were parts of you that you felt needed to be passed on. Time to learn then. Uh, this one? No. Food? It means food? <laughs> I guess so. Seems like there, are there were lots of rules, though. We had color-coded dishes. Dad's rice bowl was blue, yours was pink, mine was yellow. You said I wasn't allowed up from the table until I learned how to use chopsticks. I still can't th use them properly, to be honest. But I think this is looking right. I think we have to do the same here, right? I think so. So why do you need the small one? Uh, probably this is for vegetables, this is for rice, and this is for soy sauce or something. Maybe. Oh, she's looking uh, very strict here. Okay, mama. <laughs> so are we doing this without help now? And this one belongs here somehow. Ta-da! Ah, learning progress. Don't forget to hydrate. I'm, I'm drinking, yeah? I'm drinking. Mm, stay hydrated. Uh, maybe I need to switch it around. Nope, I need to go through. Workbooks were left unopened, and any attempt to speak in your native tongue was met by English. You tried so hard, and I didn't budge. I'm just gonna guess because I don't know. I think that was not right. <laughs> Things had to be perfect. Unlike people, glass can be polished. Spaces can be controlled the way we like. Do I have to clean now? <laughs> I think so, yeah. Well, my mom was never like that course it was just important my 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 room was okay but she never pressured me or something never eventually we stopped speaking japanese in the house 
It didn't bother me much when I was young. I never considered what that loss meant to you. Ah, uh, I can imagine how hard this is for, for parents, to be honest. Because it's part of their identity. And imagine you are not interested in that. Oh, this is not looking good. <laughs> is this good enough? I hope so. Rubber sounds. <laughs> and there's the piano. You oh good. The piano Sorry for the we late reply. Was it? No, no worries. Please don't you worry. Taught yourself to Glad you did good. Kid, but fell out of it with age. When I started showing interest, you began to give me lessons. You mean it? Uh, your voice? You mean uh, the woman? The voice in the in the back? That's not my voice, unfortunately. <laughs> she got a very nice and smooth voice. I like to listen to that. Wait, can I play piano here? hard to separate wait the is this was this on purpose it was perfect right now my hobbies and yours <laughs> it's cool that's really cool <laughs> those are the stuff we were collecting earlier I want to play more. Do I have to do something here? Huh. Oh, maybe I also need to do this here. And eventually here? No? Now I can click through. Ah, never mind. It's travel time. Is this your first time? Uh, me playing piano? No. I had piano lessons as a, when I was a child. I know uh, how to play piano a bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, the, the horse. The way Mimi can play piano and singing. <laughs> Amazing, but not simultaneously. I need to learn this again. It's very hard to play and sing. I need to I, I need to learn uh, properly a song then. It was safer to listen. What interesting perspective. Again. For a second my my I thought like my my shadow is like a bot. The piano is on the on the hill here, on the rock. I wonder if she's going to be able to play something if she wants to. Oh, that's from the beat. 
I don't remember much from that day. Maybe that's on purpose. Seagulls. Dude, I, I remember I was playing so much with the sand, sand castles and I love to do tunnels. I just love to do that. And then when the moment your fingers were grabbing each other again, that was perfect. Then you knew, yep, it's working. I am not allowed to go into the water. Oh no, please. I hope nothing bad is happening now. Making dams with sand and water. Right? That was so nice. I don't have a good feeling here. Yep, I don't have a good feeling here. Maybe that's why she said, like, she can't remember much. And look at the, the parents. Oh, God, this is... Oh, God. Yep. No, I want to go back. Help. I don't want to drown. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Don't no, I, I I tried to survive, but yeah, I had a feeling it's gonna be that bad. I just don't know where to click now. No. They could just save me in the meantime. Maybe the seagull is gonna save me now. Why do you have to click? Not the ball? It's not bugged, right? She's running. Yeah, Dad is also running here. That's weird. I can't click any on anything here. Mm, what's gonna happen when I'm going back to the apartment? I'm I'm just curious. Do you have to do the chapter again then? Oh. Within the lines. Ah, okay. Let's quickly do this again. We're not doing everything. I don't remember much from that day. Maybe that's on purpose. Let's just do it this quickly, Gum. It was just right here anyway. Mm. We should have listened to, to Mama here, huh? So this is shiny. That's why I clicked here. Same with this ball. And now? The same problem. Well, that's uh, kind of awkward, right? The birds. 
It was the bird. So the seagull is helping me. Oh, <laughs> it's a cute view. I was, so was not to shore, coughing, crying. Dad called for a lifeguard. You told me I should have listened. Of course. Yeah, I also don't have good uh, memories uh, when I was in water, unfortunately. I'm very scared of water. From then on, I told myself that if I stayed in line, I'd be safe. I could control my own actions, my behaviors. Things would be okay. In the end, it's uh, going to be always okay. Just a matter of time. For years and years, I listened. Settled into what you tried to teach me. It became rhythmic, comforting. Do you have to do something here? I assume so. Ah, there it is. Back straight, arms taut, eyes straight ahead. And so it goes. There's comfort and safety. <laughs> PPM, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Very fast. <laughs> Always Relax learning. Your shoulders. Smile. Stop tapping your foot. <laughs> Are we getting older now? The gift was thoughtful. It showed how proud you two were, and it eased my nerves about performing. More sheets, right? I knew work kept you busy. I tried not to expect anything. Chances were slim, but I found myself hoping, desperate for you to show. Hmm. Am I the only one thinking where the, the piano stands right now at the entrance is a bit, I don't know, misplaced? Shouldn't it be like more in the living room? But eventually, so everyone can listen. I had to go on without you. Damn, that's, uh, that's rough. She is uh, remembering this. Um, she rem definitely remembers that her parents weren't there um, at her concerts. That can be very rough. And it How seems like she felt... Make the time? She felt alone. I, I never asked. Maybe some things are better left alone. That feeling hurts when the parents aren't there, yeah? I mean, they're, they're probably having different reasons. My my mom couldn't make it to lots of things because, um, yeah, she was, uh, she was alone and she had to work and I was understanding and I never felt, I never felt like, mom, I'm, 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 I'm mad at you or something. I knew it was necessary. 
She she tried her very best, but I know it hurts. Where do you have to click now? It was right in front of us. <laughs> Why did I come here? There's so much I've forgotten, all for good reason. I'm here now. I made the time. I had to. There was no one else. So I can go back again? If I didn't come here to sort through your things and pack up your life, who would? Interesting. So we can decide now which memory we want to take with us. I think the horse memory was very positive and then it went a bit more with more rules. This is how she tried to learn in Japanese. This is where she started learning um, piano. But I think the piano one is having the biggest impact. So I'm going to take this. Interesting. I got so much space. to the apartment. Let's see what the new chapter is about. Is that a... What's that? Oh! A new. Falling into place. Chapter 4. Seems like things might get a bit rougher here since it's not the childhood anymore. So w I hope she's uh, not with full of problems and regrets and whatever. We'll see. I hope she had a good life. Maybe this way? Oh yeah, we have to pack the stuff now, of course. Oh, we need more colors. How? <laughs> Yeah, that's a good question, huh? It's like an old TV. You're finding, trying to find some channels, whatever. Oh, this is super hard, and I can't click through. Wait, there's another book from the other side. But I can't click that, right? <coughs> mm -mm. Funny, you don't have many options, but I'm still failing. 
Hello, it's very gray now. Or do I have to put this like where the the shadows are? Maybe I have to do that. Ah, where the shadows are. <laughs> that makes more sense. You pushed me to get good grades because you knew I was smart. But in my mind, I never knew if I was performing up to your standards. It seems very rough. Then you're never going to, I mean, you're never going to please your parents with that attitude. They need to learn that you're not perfect. All those expectations, that sounds very rough. I think that almost made it worse. I wanted a reaction. I mm. wanted your explicit approval. Mm. And some kids trying to, they are rebelling. I was desperate for praise. If you didn't tell me you were proud, to look at those awards, it meant there wasn't anything to celebrate. Wow, that sounds very rough. Hmm, so I can turn off the light. Oh, I found something. There you go. Oh, I, I love to do that. Big monster movies with him as a kid. I was probably too young, but dad was really into them. <laughs> I think that's where my fear of moths came from. Most of the time, the expectations are coming because uh, the parents didn't learn it in a different way. I think so as well, yeah. I mean, our parents always want uh, the best for us, right? They are always trying to push us as fast, not fast, but as far as possible. So I think it's very natural, but um, I think sometimes parents are overdoing it and then it just... It is very hard to fulfill those because it, it, there's always going to be someone who's going to be better than you, always. So next year vacation, we're going to do camping. <laughs> you have a camper, yeah. I mean, I think I still have my tent. I... I... <laughs> I... Um, I got that tent since my childhood, I think. I hope it's still okay. Uh, we were we were camping in our garden outside, but I never did camping properly. Why am I having this perspective now? Ah, because of that. <laughs> My parents were like, eh, good enough. That, yeah, that's that's completely fine. That's completely fine. My my mom is also like this. My dad was very, very strict. Insanely strict. Always expected me to do my, my very best. Never meant any harm. No, of course not. Of course not. They want the best for their chi children, but sometimes the parents forget how their children is with all the pressure. Of course, yeah, I 100% agree. You liked documenting holidays and sending pictures back home. 
We all dressed nicely, posed with our shoulders back. If Dad tried pulling a face, you'd hit him gently and we'd start again. We go again. I think that's too early still to do that, right? <laughs> oh, there's something here. Oh yeah, we're of course still packing stuff. What's this? You brought this back for me after a work trip. You said I would fill one eye in now, set a goal, and fill in the other after I completed it. Interesting. At the time, it made sense to focus on college. But she never did the other eye. Interesting. Maybe I can go this way now, after finding the hammer. Let's let's figure out. I think it's still a bit gray. Ah, no, it's here, right here. So something happened here. Dad always had us sit together whenever you weren't working late. It was a nice routine, something to look forward to. it when everyone was around <laughs> we fell into our roles you cooked i set the table dad did the dishes mm, a cup of tea mm, or coffee later mm. sometimes you'd be away at work for days at a time dad and i managed when the frozen dinners and takeout got old I started getting more adventurous in the kitchen. <laughs> oh, give me. <laughs> Bro, never do the other eye. That was unexpected. <laughs> no, no pressure for judge. most of the kitchen duties. You didn't always have the time, and I was good at it when I wasn't making mistakes. What mistake? Uh oh. Oh. Oh, this is such a nice effect, guys. The candle. <laughs> it's melting a bit, of course, preparing the dinner and everything. That's so cool. But that t it takes several hours, right? Oh, what happened there? Glass? Oh. Oops. Uh. Happens. Just glass. This that's such a nice effect. Wait a second, do I have to go back again? Yup. Here, there you go. Dad was always there to help fix them. <laughs> you did what? <laughs> you ordered chocomel. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm not sure if it's worth it, Josh, but yeah. I <laughs> You're going to try it now. <laughs> I hope it's going to be worth it. Unexpected. What's this again? Dad was pretty frugal. I guess it was a trait you both shared. He said he could build a playset instead of buying one. I was his helper. I think I did more damage than anything else, but 
I brought him lemonade, and that seemed to make up for it. Ooh, lemonade. Oh, it's like a blueprint. Th yeah, I think that's a blueprint. <laughs> that's cool. So it will be a treehouse, kinda. Mm, where do I have to click now? For a second, I thought I have to look up, but I can't really look up. Maybe the sun? No. Hmm. I don't have many options. My hands are looking weird here. I guess because I'm not having them behind my hand. Do I have to click on the house again? Oh no, I'm stuck. Do as well, maybe. They have really nice uh, chocolate milk here in Denmark as well, called Matilda or something. Tastes really good. Ah, from below. What a nice guy. I just don't know where to click here. Stargazing is nice, right? I love to do this as well. <laughs> oh no, thank <laughs> you. Please don't. Oh god, poor Dutch people. Oh, <laughs> you The music? There aren't any stars here. Then it's probably very cloudy right now. Ooh, jazz! Of all my memories with Dad. Listening or something to the music like that. On the front porch has to be my favorite. I think that's where I got my good taste in music. <laughs> let me try a sip of beer when I was still a kid. Don't tell your mother, he'd say. Used to do that as a kid until I fell off. Uh, not hijacking chocomol trucks, I hope. <laughs> Hopefully not. Light pollution, we probably. Also, that, yeah, depends where he lives. I hadn't been back. <laughs> so it's a bit like in Turkish. <laughs> I spent an entire summer <laughs> Lots of Tulu. <laughs> we caught beetles and watched fireworks and ate watermelon on the roof. It would be a break for everyone, especially you. A second to catch your breath and enjoy the moment. No. To rediscover what it meant to be carefree. I also want to be carefree. That's so hard. Falling from the railing, I thought so. Yeah. I mean, I'm Everyone glad it's not excited, getting chocomel trucks. <laughs> 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 
No one in the family ever had the chance to go to college, so this was big for us. I wish I could do more stargazing, but it's also very hard in my city because of the light pollution. Being carefree is very easy, streamer. Tell me your secret, Josh. College time. Things were falling into place. I'm in, I guess. Then but everything stopped. What? I think that was mom on the phone, right? And suddenly I was seven again. It was the start of summer. Dad and I were outside at night looking for ghosts. He let me hold a flashlight in case he got scared. Maybe I would be a ghost hunter. And then I was 16. He drank beers on the front porch. The record player was loud enough for him to hear from out there. I sat and listened to him talk about the music. Sometimes, we sat in silence and stared out at the sky. Stargazing is easier, I believe. Maybe, uh, depends. If you are living in a big city and there is always so much light going on, you won't see much. Same with taking uh, pictures done. In my place, you can watch the stars very well. I can imagine, you yeah. know. Same with the Desnix place. If it ain't happening right now, then it ain't happening. No point worrying. <laughs> that is true. It's just so hard to, to plan ahead. It's very hard. Very, very hard. Or you have to go to a place with less light in your area. But then I have to go very far away from my city, I think. <coughs> Today is the in my chest. Stand oh, I don't know what this is in How English. Could I feel yeah? So much and so little at the same time. I remember I I saw lots of them a couple of years ago. How was it? 2013. A couple of years ago, it's almost 10 years ago. Crazy. The peak of the meteor stream will occur on Saturday, August 13, around 3 a.m. Also in Denmark? I want to see that. Well, am I going to get awake until 3 a.m.? Be awake? I don't think so. Oh, what is this scene here, guys? Plans are just plans. Life doesn't follow a script. Yeah, as you can see here. Oh, goodness. We're in a cemetery. Falling stars? I think it's called like that, right? We lost our dad. We didn't know what to do. We handled it in different ways. <sighs> Everyone is mourning different. Things went back to normal. Routines started up again. I was angry. I wondered why you looked okay. I didn't know what to make of you. You were so stoic in the wake of his death and it confused me. Where was the pain? Why was I going through it alone? I don't think you're going alone through this. Some people are just reacting different. 
some people want to be alone and some people want to be surrounded by other people. Everyone is reacting different and we should not judge other people by the way they're mourning. Everyone is doing it in their, in their own way. And I think this is how the chapter ends. I think I'm going to take the music with me. It hits people at different times, yeah. And I can imagine her mom, or in general, when there is one parent left, they, they, they try to be strong. And sometimes uh, their kids are misinterpreting this as uh, why not showing feelings? Why can How can you live like this? But we should never judge other people the way they are I dealing with their feelings. I'm stumbling through it, trying to understand. I know now that grief is constant and always changing. <sighs> Back to the apartment. Also in Denmark, probably. I'll probably make myself a tea and sit in the car. Oh, that sounds comfy. That sounds comfy. Yeah, um, we're also having a, a balcony here. Maybe we can see it here. I, I tried to do that. When did you say? August 13, right? Is that? Oh, yeah, Saturday. Perfect. You're 100% right, Mimi. I felt the same with my mom. I can only imagine, yeah. This is probably what I would try. I would try to be strong for my kids. So imagine everyone is breaking down. Then you can't do anything. There must be always someone who's uh, doing all the stuff, right? Somehow. Next chapter, pulled over, I think it was called. It's not the same kettle anymore, right? I don't know, probably that's also the memory. Uh, I think I got enough water, but okay. Ah, okay, I have to do it. Everything turns black. It's like she's drowning in it. Oh God. I hate water. I realized later that they just wanted to be strong. I think it's very, very hard when you're, ch when you're a child, when you're starting to grow up, trying to understand what is going on. Don't be too rough with yourself, Thok. falling apart she is yeah she is it's getting too much and they're both are drifting away I, that's very interesting actually um if like a accident like this is occurring to family most families are breaking up because it's just too much for a family Her husband, with her support beam, and without the support, she would fall. Maybe, yeah. Wow, this is lots of water. And it's not just blue water, it's just black and gray. I think they want to show that their world is collapsing. Maybe that, yeah. There are a different kind of interpretation here. The house is even breaking apart, guys. It's not the same anymore. And maybe this is how she was thinking back then.
So this is the reason why she never finished the second eye. She never go. She never went to the college because her dad died. And now we're just drowning. Oh God, I hate deep water. Please let me, let me keep. I don't want water. We're going deep on the ground. I really can't move. Oh, I have to push them away. Maybe they also want to symbolic. Oh, I'm putting like a symbol show that they have uh, built a dream together. And since their husband is no longer there, everything and everything has collapsed in the, the sea of tears. That's also a nice interpretation. Yeah, a sea of tears. A nice way to say that. Hello, Jared. Thank you for the lurk and welcome to the stream. A sea of tears. I, I like that term. Was important to you and Dad, but my heart wasn't in it. No, she was, was not ready yet. Confused. Angry. Not even a year went by before I dropped out. <laughs> It was too much for her. I could also not do that. I'm way too emotional. German and Maustrinia. I think you can say the same in Sea of Tears. Time passed by while my body continued without me. I avoided your calls. I couldn't tell you I left school. It wasn't any of your business. The weight in my chest grew heavier. Every move was exhausting. When I try to remember this time in my life, it's like there's pieces missing, gaps where there shouldn't be. Time goes very fast. <laughs> Do sharks cry in the ocean? Is that what is the result? Is that the big bad joke we were waiting almost a week? <laughs> Maybe. It's looking like a diner where she's going to work now. I found a dishwashing job a while after. I figured I needed something to do, something to focus my energy on. Yeah, Anything I think so. Better than nothing. <gasps> thank you, dear Jared. Enjoy the night. Thank you. You too. Thanks for stopping by. To my surprise, I liked it. And it felt good knowing my work helped the kitchen. Because you are not using your brain. That's why it's good. But once you are yourself again, you're going to be so bored here. But yeah, at the beginning, it helps. Also with the money, of course. One day I was asked to step on the line because we were short-staffed. Is this why the restaurant called her later? I mean, earlier. It didn't take long to realize I was good at it. Being in a completely new kitchen was freeing. <laughs> I got to create my own identity my own rules but this is also what she did with her dad right interview, she cooked figuring out my place was equal parts exciting and confusing a new challenge to be faced alone you know i like the the train of thoughts here so much you're just having one item and it keeps going and going I mean, not with uh, one item, I mean memory. Hmm, the school stuff or the, the restaurant? Personally, I would take the school stuff. 
Money is good, can confirm. I'm glad you can confirm. <laughs> can you take the book? Oh, that was a short chapter. And that's like uh, her diploma. She's a chef, probably. Mise en place. Chapter 6. I made so many good memories in this kitchen. School. You're learning more about her. But she didn't go to school. She decided to... to start working which is not a bad thing I mean not everyone wants to go to school you know food was so fun when I was a kid <laughs> I'm also flavors, such a foodie textures, an adventure we took together Get me, I but now I go back. <laughs> I began to explore the possibilities. And that's the good part, myself. right? Living in in today's the time. Just figuring out what you want and going your way. I'm glad we're not forced to do uh, one profession onto the rest of our lives. Finding that fire again. Especially parents deciding for us. For Hello, Evil Evil Bacon. Hi there. Welcome to the stream. I think you're going to make some people hungry now. <laughs> I think we're collecting some fruits, not fruits, uh, mushrooms. I wish I would have n I would uh, have some knowledge with the uh, mushrooms to be honest, but I think I would kill myself very fast. Because I have zero skills with collecting mushrooms. Oh, there is one here. Is this enough? More? Yep, there is one more here. Oh, good mushroom soup. Oof. So delicious. Mushroom sauce. Mmm. So nice. Um. Do you have to write something now? Uh. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> okay, what can we write? I've spent my entire life learning how to pick mushrooms. I have no idea. How can you learn that? I guess with a person who can teach you a bit, right? I think that's the best way to learn. Do you have to write something? <laughs> hmm, what can we write? I can write, I love you. So much. That's what I can write. <laughs> wow, I'm so talented. Do you have to do something here? I guess so. Whee. My? Hmm. Alarm? Oh, yeah, we can write alarm. You're right. Alarm. Alarm. 
Alarms. Alarm zeal. No. <laughs> That's nice. Liar. Oh my god, you're right. Liar. But this is not what the the game wants. Can we actually make a whole sentence? No, like a it's something which makes sense. <laughs> Just six, what? Can you write malaria? <laughs> Malari. Malaris. That sounds like food. Hi Dan. Well, thank you so much again for the for the subscription, dear Dan. Thank you. You should have to eat the, the word blue mushrooms. That makes me pass out. But then when I wake up, it's sort of blurry. And there is the weird dragon that can talk. He teaches me. What? That doesn't sound healthy. I don't think you should eat uh, blue mushrooms. <laughs> We're missing an A. Yeah, in general, right now, I, I don't know what to write. Uh, <laughs> Maybe I don't have to do that. I think we were just... We got distracted a bit. I'm just going to take the knife here. You taught me how to hold a knife so I wouldn't cut myself. You gave Chop. me confidence in the kitchen. became muscle memory, like second nature, almost as easy as breathing. Of course, he's better now. Mmm, carrots. Miss <laughs> <Good enough. laughs> Six years old again. I don't think there is one. Trying my best I mean, I hope so. Getting in your but way. I don't think there are different endings. Stop debating me! What are they even doing? Carrots are good. First Carrots are very good. Line, very tasty. I knew this is what I wanted to do. Thank you so much Practiced for the Lurker Bacon. Put what you taught me to use. The confidence you instilled reminded me I wasn't bad at this. Of course I not. Fast. Oh, this is looking good. Wait, I think I, I made a mistake. No, I don't know how many. I just saw there were three red dots. Okay, we're going to create my own style. Not too bad. <laughs> A rice cooker. Mandatory here. Oh no, I don't want to do this again. I need a hidden message somewhere. The Y is the capital, so I guess it starts with Y. Probably, yeah. Good point. Good point. I didn't even <laughs> think about that. Jams, nice. Or yams. Well, that's a long table here. Big garden, garden party. I 
Ah, this is where the memories come from. I see. Hope everything is packed here now. Oh wait, there are notes here, right? Need to collect this as well. And I think now th this is just left. Hmm. All right, let's give it a another try. So Jashi said it started with this one. I mean, these one are flag hearing, right? Yisol. Dude, I'm just guessing. Maybe I missed something else. Another memory, maybe? Yes. Cookie. You were very particular about the process of cooking. There wasn't room for creativity. A recipe had to be followed. The gyoza had to be folded a certain way. A certain way? Uh, I guess I'm just gonna drop everything here. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna follow you. Guess she was not happy with the way I did this. <laughs> no freedom for creativity. Nope. Not allowed. mindset that need for perfection is what I retained keep a tidy workstation and kitchen clean as you go hello Billy hi good to see you how are you doing you doing good when I got older you started working more we spent less time cooking together but I was determined to keep it up mm-hmm <laughs> Cookie time. My sister's addicted to making kiwasa and you know, <laughs> they're very delicious. Oh my god. Understandable addiction to be honest. Very understandable. I'm alright. How are you doing, Mimi? I am doing way better. Uh, I got sick and um, I couldn't stream the whole week, but now I'm back again. It feels good to be back again. Thank you for asking, Billy. And um, I'm glad you're doing alright. Where am I going to click now? Rice cooker? Hmm. I'm clicking everywhere. Okay, I don't know what to do here. Cookie clicker? Oh, it's it's right here. Into my 20s, this drive for perfection became everything. It consumed me. It gave me a sense of control. After many late nights, being the last in the kitchen, that dedication took me to the top. 
That's that was nice to see her. Now she's the one teaching uh, other people. I hope she's not raging though. Only twenties, yeah. Crazy, right? But she was working hard. I would just know where to click. Hat chef. Hell yeah. Work is distracting pretty good, to be honest. But you need to get the motivation to get there. Not gonna lie, this chapter is harder to click. <laughs> I didn't expect I'm gonna say that. Um, hmm. <coughs> Probably it's something super small, and I just didn't see it so far. I cannot try to zoom out the whole time. But it's not possible. Where do you have to click? Guys, did you see something shiny? Let me know, yeah? Life is a log road, one day at a time. That's also what Desnick's uh, saying. I got an email from uh, one of my lecturers today. Lecturers today? He was notifying and congratulating me because I've been picked to be the co-recipient of this year's Stanford History Group Prize for the best dissertation in history for my university. What? Damn, Billy. That's, that sounds really good. Congratulations. That sounds really good. Wow. In history. That's so nice. Congrats. Well, I'm trying to figure out where I do have to click. <laughs> That's very nice to hear, Billy. Congratulations. I think we're going to stay on to lower 60s or something because I don't know where to click. It's because he contacted that Norwegian. You even remember that, Josh? Crazy, that's, that's such a long time ago. I wasn't expecting my dissertation to turn out this well. Well, it is good, it seems like. <laughs> wow. That uh, sounds like a really good prize. Yeah, I don't know where to go here. Where to click. I was thinking I need to follow the finger. Like, okay, just go this way. <laughs> like, my brain just does stuff. Josh, what do you have to do here? Where do I have to click? Tell me. Almighty Josh, tell me. What's the item I have to click here? I really can't see. You can probably hear that I'm clicking around like crazy, right? I wish there would be a mode with g give me hints. Maybe they forgot to implement. I can't al also open anything here. You need to click on one specific item, otherwise there is no, no way to do that. Well, uh, okay, I have no idea. And I think I clicked everywhere now.
My fingers are hurting. Are you here? How old are you? Give me a sign. <laughs> Ceiling or something? Let me see. No. But I clicked everywhere now. It seems like I missed one little thing. It's not in existing. <laughs> Do you want to play Fasmo? No. I'm too spooked of Fasmo. I want to play a hint sign. But what's the item? Guys, what's the item? Do you have to do everything again? No, right? Hindsight. Hindsight. As I opened Hindsight. each cabinet, Hindsight. clearing out Hindsight. the contents, everything started to hit me. Wait, that's new, right? I can't remember this scene. Maybe it was buggy. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Daz. Thank you so much for the bits. Huh. My hard well? work paid off. I was the one giving orders, creating dishes, curating entire menus. Into the I fire. Had control and creativity to do what I wanted. People started to notice. They came from everywhere. Critics started talking about us. The more we got noticed, the harder I worked. Oh, I have to click here. Newspaper. The rush was amazing. Wow, I dude. Was so busy. It left little time for you. Sometimes we'd grab lunch, but I wanted to. I thought that I needed to show you the result of all my hard work. To show you what I built for myself. That led to finding the right place to open my own restaurant. To be my own boss. So much responsibility, to be honest, Fusa. Oh, <laughs> dear Soggy, thank you. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so, so much for gifting three subs and reaching my daily sub. Thank you. You're very, very kind. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you so, so much. I appreciate it a lot. Cheers, Dad. Cheers, Dad. Thank you, dear Thuggy. Thank you. And then a call. None of it mattered anymore. I think, I think she didn't spend much time with her mom, right? Yeah, that's the call that, she has, that she's not doing well. Scam train soon? <laughs> indeed, indeed. <laughs> thank you so much for all the support, thank you. You're always very welcome, you're too kind. Way too kind. I hate getting cold. Oh, we're back here in the kitchen again. Ah, and the puzzle is gone here. And I think we got everything now to, to finish this chapter. So are we taking the recent memory with the knife or to the one where we, we were baking cookies. Hmm. I'm going to take the, the cookie one. So what's the story behind this game? The story is we're traveling through time a bit. 
um, we're going, uh, we're looking back on our life. Enter your message. Well, I didn't see this feature here. Now I know. What the hell? Oh my god, I got, I got scared. Oh yeah, you can, you can have another text-to-speech, yeah. That just scared me. That's the text-to-speech from Sound Alerts. <laughs> that just scared me like crazy. I think I'm gonna disable this. <laughs> I wanna hear Justin. Justin is uh, not that creepy. Oh god, I thought the game is speaking to me. Desnix, thank you for the 100 bits. <laughs> you can't know. Don't be, please don't be. It's fine. It's completely fine. Next chapter. Chapter 7, Borrowed Lines. <laughs> creepy computer. <laughs> it's so creepy, right? Son Kenny. <laughs> you can't notice. I'm not sure I'm ready to go through your things. It doesn't feel right, intruding on your space like this. Oh, that's mu this must be so hard now. Oh, God. Oh, my God. This sounds very, very rough. Not sure if I could do that. You worked a lot. At one point, it seemed like your job took over the life you built. Your work followed you home and never left. It became part of our family dynamic, creeping into weekends or late nights after dinner. Damn. You <laughs> were so scared. <laughs> we all got scared. Yeah, lots of documents here. Where to click through? Ah. Oh. Sometimes. Wanted to clock to activate the hype train, then you figure it out. Wait, I can also jump scare people. <laughs> shut, and her quiet footsteps creep past my bedroom. But I think if you if we want to activate the hype train, it needs to be a third person. But thank you for, for trying. I really appreciate the support. Thank you so much, guys. For my daily self go. thank you for gifting the subs and for the bits. Thank you. It's very kind. Very, very kind. There was a text to sweet uh, speak hours, speech the feature there at the end. Yeah, I know. I just activated it a couple of days ago, but I figured out that's not necessary. Since we have Justin speaking for us. Maybe we're getting the point of view of uh, the mom now. Maybe it was the routine. Each day was different, but there were always elements that could be controlled, especially at home. Hmm, where do you have to click again? You me playing the click game. Ah, the glasses. Even also interesting, the, um, you the decision with the colors. When the dad was still alive, it was still having warm colors. Now it's just cold. We talked about going to Japan together. It had been a long time since we'd gone back. It'd be different this time. We'd create new memories as adults. I can't believe you actually bought plane tickets. But I was scared of leaving my work behind. Everything would fall apart if I left. 
Sh so she didn't I do tried it. To tell you, and you just nodded. Oh, she must be very sad there. Sometimes I'd forget holidays. It was late into the night before I'd call. If I called at all. If I called at all, it's uh, a really hard relationship between those two after the death. It's really hard. And I think she's also feeling bad about it. Now the time is just gone and you can't see your mom anymore. I can't. I can't do it. The longer I'm here, the more I think about you. The what ifs, the things I can't change about us. I created an idea of the kind of person you were, but I never stopped to ask if that was you. Time didn't fail us. I did. I need to go. And then it's too late. Because you can't bring back time anymore. This is also why I try to fix things now. All at once, I saw my future laid out in front of me. I fly back to open the restaurant. I want to go to Japan, Japan one day. Hopefully you can do it one day. I'd achieve everything Stuck I was there for accomplish. three weeks and uh, he loved it there. Years would pass and I'd be there. Night after night. Come home late one night and wonder how things could have been different. I love Japan and the food. Nothing I would love the food, I guess. The end if I run away I'm such a foodie. Of you. Oh, I need to pull that. Are these yours? <laughs> what a nice effect again, huh? How did I never know? What other parts of your life was I oblivious about? She didn't know that her mom was uh, drawing, painting. Want to go to Korea learning. too? How's the when the I learning going, watching. Billy? When you were all alone. I wish I could have known you more as a person. It's hard to picture the leap you took to get here. One of the biggest decisions of your life. A 
that it was exciting and terrifying. Need to save up money before I can go and study there. Ground. Sounds so uh, reasonable, yeah. When I ventured on my own. Sounds like a good idea. I also want to go to Indonesia very much. Oh yeah? How come? Sounds like you need to do uh, an Asia tour at some point. Through Asia. Where do I have to click now? Oh, over here. I didn't think you actually kept these. Of course, you were the I daughter, right? From each other. The pride we felt. The love we held. It's basically the purpose of my job right now. To just save money for either doing my masters or just whatever else I decide to go, of course. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. <laughs> I mean, getting money is never a bad idea, right? <laughs> oh, I have to click here. Because of the food in the culture. <laughs> Understandable. You did. I couldn't see it at the time. Can I yank one cookie? Of course, a digital one. It was hard on you when I left. I was too absorbed in myself to notice. <laughs> Yeah, she wanted to leave everything behind. But then they just drifted away from each other. You used to wear this all the time. A gift from Dad, I think. You loved it. You wore it a lot, especially on business. You wanted me to have it after Dad died, but I didn't want it. I really do need to set the time aside to learn Korean again. I've slept so hard. I mean, if you're doing this, like, I don't know, 15 minutes per day, 20 minutes per day, that's, I think that's doable, right? trying to motivate it myself to do during soon. my quiet time rather than just sit here I doing nothing you understand you just put like i don't know 20 minutes are a good time to learn right then you can say at least i did something today it took a long time to understand that it was your way of reaching out of helping me keep a part of him yeah you see everyone is dealing different with that. With the loss of somebody beloved. It tore you apart too. But you managed to hide it under the surface. She couldn't hug her little girl anymore. You 
you were trying to be strong. I thought so, yeah. For both of us. Oh, it's always like that. My shifts at work have been quite enough that I've considered trying to learn when I'm on retail since I don't have to go and check their screens or anything, even half an hour. So I'm usually stood there wishing I was <laughs> I think that's a good time to learn. And maybe you can do that uh, at work a bit. I need to go back to learning Dothraki. That sounds uh, very <laughs> rough, Epsi. But yeah, like I said, 20 minutes a day. So we got uh, these memories here. What are we, what are we going to take? What is this here? Oh, that was the... Um, mm, okay, yeah. The package we found. And not the package, the jewelry. I'm going to take that. It may be too late to make things right with you, but I need to finish this out. It's the least I can do. Finding peace while your parents are gone, I think that's very hard. Oh, let's see how she's doing this. Chapter 8, what we keep. They're always with us, though, always. I've been running away from the things I can't control my entire life. Can at least spend it? I feel like they've been frozen in time waiting to be played over and over again in my mind. Can at least spend the half an hour break I get doing some, like you said, 20 or so minutes a day should still be helpful. In my opinion, you can still uh, say I did at least something, you know, instead of saying I, I did nothing. And within tw 20 minutes a day, you can still reach a lot. Even if you were just re repeating things, you know? The seagulls are still flying overhead. I can still taste the salt water in my mouth. Mm, salty water. Blech. Wait, can I click on this again? I like to get food. I uh, know I like to get good enough to do the test of proficiency and to get graded on it, even if I don't go and study. Yeah, I mean, I had I had some friends who were doing Erasmus semester and they came back and they were like, "Yep, I didn't do even one or two courses, but I learned so much and uh, I am not regretting it." Sorry. I'm 13 again and upset you missed that night. You tried to explain yourself, but I wouldn't listen. I couldn't. Yeah, this feels very much like the end. I think we're going through every chapter again now and finding somehow peace. I can still see myself on that bench. I felt everything and nothing all at once. I didn't know how to handle dad being gone. I looked to you as my guide to grief, but you were stoic. It confused me, angered me, left a grudge.
When I got news you were gone, it was like my body moved without me. I left the phone and went back to work like nothing had changed. I couldn't help but picture myself leaving. I don't like this last chapter. It's too emotional. I wasn't ready to confront it. Where do I have to go now? Let me see. Probably this way. Yep. Hi, Sinister. Hola. Welcome to the stream. a cave maybe what does life look like when we come to terms with the past how do I make that work maybe I'm not supposed to know life is a mystery huh <laughs> <laughs> My brain got confused. He says, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I like to know what you say. <laughs> yeah. It's also what Jeremy people are saying. Did we win yet? Um, maybe. If it means we, we found peace uh, with our inner selves, maybe. decided to use those tickets. <laughs> Summer fool. A, a new word uh, I learned today. I'm hoping to get to know you better. Who you were. Where you came from. When I go back home, I'll have these pieces of my past waiting for me. Reminders of the good and bad. But I'll also be carrying them with me, wherever I go, ingrained in my bones. But I think it's a great idea to, to step on your mom's foot, to take those steps, I should say. 
to learn more about her. That's what she wanted to do with her. I think that's it. Hindsight. I'm very proud of myself. I didn't cry this time. <laughs> and yeah, if somebody wants to know who the voice actor is, Reiko Aylesworth. She got a very nice voice. It was nice to listen to her voice. Overall, um, a very nice game. Might have been a bit too short, some people might say, but it was a good interactive story. It was uh, containing some nice art, the voice acting was really good, and the story was good. About loss and reflecting about everything, what happened, and taking other perspectives, you know? I'm, I'm glad um, Annapurna Interactive, um, I just saw it here, that they um, are the publishers here. I'm, I'm glad they are giving uh, other little teams mm, the chance to, to publish uh, this these kind of games. <laughs> Great game when I cry a lot. That's okay. That's completely okay. You can just let it out. Crying helps me to um, to control my feelings, to be honest. Such a nice game. So, so nice. Yeah, it felt like I'm watching a movie with you guys, to be honest. Yeah, uh, a drama. I'm very proud I didn't cry. <laughs> very nice story. I liked it a lot. And the music was great. The atmosphere was really good. And those are the memories I, I brought with me. <laughs> And then you can play again if you want to. Maybe you can get also different kind of items, but I don't think it makes a difference. I don't think so. Oh, dear bro bros, that was a very nice game. Um, short, but uh, really good, I should say. Um, it was like watching a movie together, an interactive movie. I like I like that a lot. So it was like a walking simulator, uh, more or less, uh, with a bit of perspective play and lots of symbols metaphors really well made really really good um you can see there were some strong uh, writers here um so yeah i i really enjoyed my time it was really good <laughs> <laughs> 